So for a make two rows above row one. So I'm just going to insert and put two rows in there. Key the title most watched videos here into this. So this is most watched videos. That's an A1. And it says to merge and center this across A1 over to G1. So I'm going to do that. And increase the font size to 20. So I'll put this to 20. Okay, so bold, four D's is bold rows one, two, and three. So I like this. It's bold. It makes everything bold. According to the data, there still seems to be some confusion around it. So you want to, when you sort the data, you want to highlight all of your data, including the headings. So then you can do this. And it says sort by views, sort by views, and then sort by smallest. And it arranged everything. So you get a column heading rank. And so right here, rank is already bold. So you can read that. Um, see, for this format cells F4 through GH. So F4 through GH. Do these as a number, and then comma separator, and then you also have zero. And then change the particular name. The sheet, the sheet one down here, we want to give data. So we click name, do the name, and change it to computers. Okay, so that is the charts E3 through G15. Okay, insert I want to do a column chart, which is right here. And it says first 2D column. So this one, okay, that's a good chart. So move this just. So then you want to change the title. So in here I can feel like this text here is to total views and rows. Response. Change the this is to views. Um, there we go. And then okay, so now we'll pick the background color. I click anywhere in the background. I want the whole chart to be uh, light green, which is this one right here. So if you click that, it's going to make the whole chart look light green. Uh, I'm on step nine. So nine says from the chart tools design tab right here, chart layout group right here, do the following area, select the chart area, and total views downloaded, select the layout nine. So we can here, put that here. This is a quick down menu. The nine, which is the instructions right here. Nine. So I'm going to choose that one. Okay. And then also, I want to add change my elements over here. This is where you can change some of your elements. Click that. Notice this, I want to go primary, horizontal, select 
grid lines. Now notice when you go to grid lines, there's a little arrow over here. So you can see the grid very horizontal, very minimal horizontal, but it is also very minimal vertical. So that's what I want to do here. Uh, also, column chart. Now, the ten is pretty bad to a couple of copy of the first few items. Okay, click on here. We'll copy, click on the word copy. So I just created a new one because I'm going to rename this to Premap Data. And Alright, so I'm going to do Hide columns C, D, and S. Hide columns. I like C and D. Click. Or press on the C. You hit the C. Okay, for it to be my category. And then from the chart tools, so now I'm up here, chart tools, design tab, chart styles group, which is this right here. I'd select the chart area, the most download videos, tree map chart. Choose the style below. So if my chart's already selected, I'm going to choose this chart right here, just going to make the, uh, basically the border black. Change, okay, so that's done that. We click out of that. Then change the border of your sheets. Just data sheet. Click and drag, little arrow move to where we put it. Proofread your work. And then this is so this is done. Yeah. Yeah, data. Here. Right. Okay. Got that done. You are done. And it's submitted. If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks.